Recess. The first time I heard that word was in first grade, and I had no idea what it meant. Okay, children. It's recess time. Huh? What's that? What's recess? Is that like peanut butter and chocolate? Mmm, chocolate. <coughs> no, dum dum. It means we're playing outside for like 15 minutes. Most of the time, we'd usually play grounders, soccer, or some kind of tag. If you don't know what grounders is, it's basically tag on the playground. But the person who's it closes their eyes whenever they step off the ground and onto the playground. And if they ever yelled, GROUNDERS! And you were the last person still touching the ground, then you were now it. Now, soccer, for those of you living in Australia, is what we call it because clearly the name football is already taken. Oh, hello. Who are you? My name is football. One time, we were playing group tag, and it was boys versus girls. My school at the time had portables, which are these classrooms not connected to the main building. Long story short, I was chased up the stairs, and now I had to run down the ramp. I was about to jump off at the halfway point, but my short little legs couldn't get over the railing fast enough, and she was right on my tail. So I had to run straight toward another girl who was guarding the bottom. At the last second, with no options left, I went, uh, 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 ducked under their legs and hightailed it out of there. Haha, <laughs> so long, suckers. When I wasn't in the mood for strenuous physical activity, you'd probably find me hunched over looking at other people play Yu-Gi-Oh and Beyblade. Fun fact, my first Beyblade Bit Beast was this one that I found on the floor during the bus ride home. And my first Pokemon card was a Pikachu card that I found stuck in a library book. Anyways, in third grade, my brother was finally old enough to understand that recess is not chocolate. So now I started hunching over to watch his friends play Game Boy Advanced. And then, if I was lucky, I'd get to borrow it and play Game Boy. After I switched schools in fourth grade, I didn't get to play on anyone's Game Boy. Because we were playing on the Nintendo DS instead. <laughs> the last time that I had recess was on the last day of sixth grade. My friends and I knew that this was going to be the last time we had recess ever since apparently you don't get recess in middle school. We had to make this one count. Someone eventually had the brilliant idea that we all slide down one of the curly slides on the school playground. But instead of getting off like a normal person, we would pile up on top of it. That, that's stupid. Your, your idea's stupid. This is so dang stupid, it just might work. Cue the kindergarten flashbacks. It was gym class, and two people ended up tripping over. So all of us kids gathered around. <gasps> oh no, sh should we help them? Then some kid, out of nowhere, goes, FOOTBALL TACKLE! By the time our teacher noticed, more than half the class was already on top. She came rushing over, trying to stop us. The guy on the bottom, let's call them Alex, was like, <gasps> Dead! <laughs> I'm just kidding. B but for real though. Because of this, I knew that whoever went first down the slide would be crippled with a hunched back for the rest of their life from the weight of everyone on top of them and the weight of the emotional trauma. So I waited until only one more person could fit on the slide. Me. But what I didn't realize was that this guy could buckle. Leaving more room for people to pile on top of me. One of the supervisors came rushing over to stop us, but we were already falling off the slide and crushing people on the bottom. <laughs> It was pretty fun. <laughs>